Understanding Gear Ratio. Hello, dear learners. Today, we're going to dive into a mechanical phrase that you might have come across, gear ratio. This is especially common when talking about bicycles, cars, or any machinery with gears. By the end of this video, you'll have a clear understanding of what it means and why it's important. Before we jump into the gear ratio, let's first understand what a gear is. Gears are round pieces, often made of metal or plastic, with teeth around their edges. They are used in machines to transmit motion or to change the speed or direction of motion. When two gears are meshed together, turning one gear will turn the other. Now, onto the main topic, gear ratio. The gear ratio is a way to describe the relationship between the number of teeth on two gears that are meshed or connected. It tells us how many times one gear will turn when the other does a single rotation. For instance, if one gear has 10 teeth and another has 20 teeth, the gear ratio is 1 to 2. This means for every single turn of the first gear, the second gear will turn twice. You might be wondering, why do I need to know this? Gear ratios are crucial in many applications. 1. Vehicles. In cars, gear ratios in the transmission can determine how fast the car can go or how much power it can produce. 2. Bicycles. For cyclists, different gear ratios will make it easier or harder to pedal, especially when going uphill or on flat surfaces. 3. Clocks. In timepieces, gear ratios are essential to ensure that the hour, minute, and second hands move correctly. 4. Machinery. In industrial settings, machines use specific gear ratios to perform tasks at desired speeds and power levels. Understanding gear ratios can help in selecting the right machinery, enhancing performance, and achieving desired results in various scenarios. And that wraps up our lesson on the term, gear ratio. We hope this video has shed some light on this mechanical concept. Remember, it's all about understanding the relationship between two gears. The next time you're on a bicycle or in a car, just think about those gears working together, all thanks to their gear ratios. Happy learning!